So a few weeks back on the channel, we looked at how to deal with spam or scam callers on the iPhone, but what do we do about texts or iMessages? Let's take a look. Hi guys, I'm Simon, this is Tech My Life video, and as I do every week on the channel, this is a Tuesday tech tip. So do that if you want this or more great tech content. But as I mentioned in the intro, uh, I did a video a few weeks back about scam or spam callers. I'll chuck a link up there to that one. But this week we're gonna deal with text messages and add some filters and also a notification setting to try to reduce kind of interruption from unwanted text messages. So let's jump onto the phone. So you're probably used to seeing this screen. So basically it's your message screen. I've blurred a few things out because I don't want you reading my messages, but pin conversations at the top and your other messages underneath. Let's jump over to settings. So on the settings page, scroll down. It's the fifth section down and it's the one with passwords at the top. Now, halfway in that section, halfway down, you're gonna see three green icons and the middle one is messages. So let's click on messages. On the messages page, start by scrolling all the way to the bottom. Now, three sections up, it's message filtering and filter unknown senders. So we're gonna to toggle that one on. Now let's just jump back across to messages. Now, in the top left corner, you'll see it says filters. So click on that and it'll take you back and it's a bit more maybe like email. So now we've got all messages, known senders, and unknown senders. So unknown senders is going to be a bunch of phone numbers with a bunch of random messages. So that's kind of taken care of that. Now you can go into your known senders and it's not going to have all those kind of other messages. But let's jump back across to settings and we're going to scroll back to the top of settings. You can either do that manually by scrolling or just tap just under messages at the top and it'll automatically jump up to the top. Then we're gonna click on notifications just at the top there. And again, scroll down to the bottom and this time customize notifications. And the second one down is allow notifications unknown senders and we'll toggle that one off. So now those unknown senders, they're gonna go into a separate mailbox but you're also not gonna get notifications about them. For me, I find this really helpful. If you run a business and you're getting lots of messages from new numbers, you might just need to test to see how this works for you. And you also need to make sure you add people to your, your address book so they go into your known senders. But I've found it super, super helpful. And especially the less notifications, the better in my world. I'm Simon, this has been Tech My Life Video, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.